On 90 Day Fianza Happily ever after, Yara and Jovi admit they expected Mila's grandmother Gwen to help out more. But fans think that's unreasonable. On 90 Day Fianza Happily ever after, Jovi Dufren and Yara Zaya have been working through a rough patch with Jovi's mother Gwen. And most 90 Day Fiancé fans agree that the couple is being completely unreasonable. After their 90 Day Fiancé season 8 debut, Yara and Jovi quickly became an iconic franchise couple and have built a comfortable life for themselves. Appearing on spin-offs like Pillow Talk and 90 Day Diaries, the two have become 90 Day Fiancé mainstays and are now a featured couple on Happily Ever After. Season 7 Outside the show, Yara makes a killing through her online clothing and makeup sales, and with Jovi and baby Myla, the three appear to be a happy family. In recent episodes, viewers were stunned to learn that Jovi and Yara had a falling out with 90 Day Fiancé fan favorite Mrs. Quinn. The Cajun woman gained popularity on season 8, and viewers thought the new grandmother was sassy and endearing, and they couldn't get enough of her. But this season, Gwen has not seen her son, daughter-in-law, and granddaughter in months. Jovi was furious with his mother that she had not seen Yara during the month he was away at work, and the three were left in an awkward situation. On a boat trip, they all managed to bury the hatchet, though it was clear that communication broke down because Jovi and Yara expected Gwen to take a highly active role taking care of Myla. However, Gwen asserted, I love being a grandmother, but I'm nobody's nanny. On the show, Yara admitted that Gwen turned out to be a different grandmother than I expect her to be. She had hoped Gwen would every single day will come, take the kids, will go with them somewhere. Unfortunately for Yara, fans on Reddit were very much on Gwen's side. In a thread started by you slash green goddess 800, and 31, one fan argued, it is not Miss Gwen's responsibility to provide care for the child. Gwen should be able to enjoy visits and time with the grandchild when she has time. But it should never be an expectation. The vast majority of fans in the thread felt Jovi and Yara's expectations were completely unreasonable and were supportive of Gwen. With one Redditor saying, Gwen deserves to have boundaries in her own life. Other 90 Day Fancy fans pointed out that Yura lives three hours away, and if she wanted help from Gwen, she shouldn't have moved so far from her support system. There were many fans who brought up instances from Yura's past, when she felt that Gwen was overbearing about the way she was raising Myla. Now it seems things have changed and Yura feels slighted that Gwen is not helping out more. Several commenters questioned why Jovi and Yara wouldn't just hire a nanny if they were feeling so overwhelmed. After all, the couple appears to be doing quite well financially and are one of the few franchise parents who would have no problem affording childcare. Of course, there were 90-day fancy fans who felt Yura, Jovi, and Gwen resolved things in a very mature way on the show. Both sides admitted to making incorrect assumptions and expressed a desire to communicate better in the future. On 90-day fianza, happily ever after, Yara confessed, I probably expect Mrs. Gwen to be the same like my mom. Which was not smart for myself because all the people are different. She demonstrated impressive self-awareness, as did Jovi when he apologized for the way he behaved. Hopefully this is the start of a new chapter for the 90-day fiancé couple and Mama Gwen.